Well, what's up, everybody? Good morning. It's not even good morning, really. It's like 10. Um, of course, as you can see, I got the baby. And um, I'm trying to get my day started. And it's a little rough today. Um, my kids are on their Zoom meetings and I have another child that is um, having some difficulties getting on Zoom. Um, so she's <laughs> doing nothing. And um, my father, I need to take his head out, his hair out and comb it and moisturize it and all that jazz. I have not yet ate this morning, so um, <clears throat> I'm on a no sugar diet, <clears throat> but I still need to eat because I am nursing and it just makes it difficult to wake up in the morning and not really, um, and not really trying to make sure I'm not covering the microphone here and I'm um, not really having an appetite, but um, yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna try that acai bowl. And I also have some Asian pears that I'm gonna try to eat this morning as well, as long as she lets me eat. I already started dinner, got the crock pot going. Um, at about one, I'm gonna cook my penne noodles, just so I can have them prepared. We probably won't eat dinner until six. But I want to just have it prepared so when we're ready to eat, I'm just like putting a sauce on things and getting things ready. Um, my toddler has been on his laptop today. So, uh, I mean on his tablet today learning. So that's good. I got to do a little straightening up. Um, I don't like my incense. I'm going to do a little bit of the laundry. And I'm supposed to be getting on the computer to do some work, but it has been very difficult um, because I have so much other things to do. I'm probably going <clears> to <throat> put the baby in a stroller, take her for a walk so I can get her calmed down so she can sleep so that I can come back and try to do some work. Um, but yeah, that's about it. And just a word to the wise, because somebody's going to say, oh, you put cereal in her milk for, so that she can be able to sleep. That's not good. No, it's not for her to be able to sleep. It's actually um, to keep food on her belly because my daughter digests food very quickly. Um, and she doesn't have a lot of substance on her belly. 
so that's what um, these are for so all right you guys this is I finally got to sit down and eat breakfast this is my breakfast I got some Asian pears um, I have some acai made by Dole um, and then I'm eating a Belvita and then I have me some water which I'm trying to drink more water I use some of it to put in the baby's um, apple juice but I got some I got some water my son oh my goodness my um and then let me do a real quick black business highlight real quick so um this drink right here the way that I stumbled upon it is and I seen this tea and I was like, oh, what drew me to it was, first of all, said Jamaican sweet tea. And another thing is that I read that it has hibiscus. Um, they've changed the packaging since the first time I had it because before the, it used to say up here, it said like hibiscus, rose hips and something else, which it actually says it right here now. Let's see if I can zoom that in. Hibiscus, rose hips, mint and honey, right? So I was like, oh, and I'm a huge fan of hibiscus because I have high blood pressure and hibiscus is really good for helping folks with heart issues. So, you know, the, the thing, anything red helps the heart. So I'm like, okay, give me some, let me taste that. So I got it, I bought it home. It was sitting in my refrigerator for a couple of days before I decided to try it. And then I was like, okay, let me read the ingredients and everything that's in it so I can see what I'm about to put into my body. Read the ingredients. Pretty easy, huh? No crazy stuff, no nothing that you're like, what'd I say? What that what could I can't I don't know what that mean. And you know, it's for sugars, carbohydrates, all of that. I'm like, okay. So then um I read the little story and then something tells me to go online when I see that the uh founder is from Detroit, Michigan. I'm like, let me go online and read the history about this here. So, all right, as I'm reading history, I crack it open and I drink it. And it is absolutely amazing. And again, I found out that the owner is black. And I'm like, yes, yes, lady, yes. And so I've been telling everybody I know about it. And I also faithfully drink it. So I'm not just going to tell you about it and not drink it. I'm not being paid for this. I'm not. Um, this is not a paid promotion. This is nothing. This is my honest opinion about this drink it's really really good i like it and then i found out that kevin hart um stands behind her drink i think he had invested in her or something like that but either way i like it regardless of whether she somebody was invested in her or what you all right oh you took your run so i really do like it um my son over there just took his run you ain't really see him but he's sweating up a storm but this is really good and I absolutely love it. You heard me? So let me uh, get into eating my breakfast. I'm going to check uh, my Facebook and stuff while I'm sitting down. Because once I put my phone down, I'm designed. And like these acai bowls are really good. They give you instructions on heating them up in the microwave if you want to dethaw them or stuff. But they taste really good frozen. And uh, just like that. I eat it just like that and it comes with granola and I think those is toasted almonds or either those are coconut shavings on the top I'm not 100% sure yeah uh, it has coconut shavings strawberries blueberries I don't see no blueberries in there but I'm asking my business um, blueberries and honey oat granola And then I have, like I said before, I have my Asian pears. My son just went for a run. And he's soggy. My daughter and her goofy self. Got my incense. Gonna go ahead and light my incense. This incense is called Eve's Aroma. And I like the jumbo sticks. Well, I guess they're called the jumbo sticks, but these last about an hour. <clears throat> as far as um, when they're, you know, how long they stay lit. And I like it. I got my incense lit. I ate some breakfast. Um, probably going to do a smoothie for lunch, but it's already 12 o'clock and I just ate breakfast. 
so if I don't do a smoothie by 3, 30, 4 o'clock, I probably won't drink one because then I'll turn around and then dinner will be at 6. So, oh well. It was life, right? So now I'm just taking my computer into my family room so that I can try to get some work done. The baby is currently in their sleep with my youngest daughter. And if I can keep her asleep, that would be awesome. I mean, I'm going to wake my, my daughter up because she has to go back to class. Um, but they're on like a little break. So if I can um, keep her asleep, that will be top-notch perfection. <laughs> top-notch perfection. Um, while the kids are still in school, I'm not really able to straighten up because running a vacuum and moving around too much. Um, my little baby is a light sleeper. She is a lightweight. And to make noise and wake her up is like crazy. So um, I try to move in silence, right? So, yeah, I'm trying to move in silence here because what I don't want, has, like I said before, I don't want to wake this child up, put this out in the garage. Um, yeah, so that's about it. Like I said, I'm trying to straighten up. I normally put my instant out in the vestibule area so it can smell up the whole house. I gotta put my carpets back down. My little rugs. Should I say? I don't know why I call them carpets. I gotta put my little rugs back down. They gotta take these towels and underwear and stuff upstairs. It's been folded. I keep my mask up there. I just got so much going on, y'all. Hey. Hey. Thanks for watching them. Make the pizza. The first ever Unicorn GX. For an eligible view of lessons, give us no one who's recent 2022 Encore GX for around 179 per month. Hi! Hi! Hi, baby! Okay. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Hi. How are you? Mm -mm. Uh, pauses for social distancing. A Canadian couple got married on the U.S. border so they could have Cheese. About 50 guests watched from the Canadian side, another 15 loved ones watched from across the river in Maine. And the pandemic did not stop the Pittsburgh for a time, the knot. Due to the fires and the incremental.